Hey guys, Spray here, and welcome to episode 12 of my Let's Play of Mountain Blade with Fire and Sword. Alright, so... I think... Okay, I, I took a little break between this episode and the last episode, so I have no idea... Okay, we're... Okay, so, last episode, we kind of got... I don't want to say butt raped, but we kind of got raped a lot last episode. I think we died, we got like captured two times, and it was terrible. But uh, it's okay now because we're we're back in our own friendly territory, and we're gonna go ahead and grab as much militia as we go. Oh, no, 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 go away, go away, go away, go away, go away. No, no, no. They're so fast. We're so slow. I'm going to Biscov. Please let me hide here. Maybe there's some... Oh, we could probably... I haven't looked in like a million years. Oh, hey, Aldergrass. Why are you... Oh, Fadot. Hello. You want to join me? Um, perhaps I'm looking your son on that core... Oh, you deserted the service, huh? Yeah, you speak the truth. But I fled, wouldn't you? I came from Tulub, and in recent years I've served as a Moscow marksman and once a famed hunter. Awesome, so he's going to be pretty cool. So he was a secret department clerk, a skinny, wall-eyed fellow goatee, but he set his sights on me, on my wife. Oh, no. The foul creature knew that she was faithful to me, but he devised a dirty trick using his powers that came with his position. He whispered to the chief hunting clerk that I bespoasted in front of the men that I saw a wondrous horse in the woods that a horn on its head. Our sire was quite keen on rare animals, and so I was entrusted with the task of capturing this creature or get fired and thrown into the gall for my idle talk. Wow. Follow me. I can't promise you a horse with horns, but there shall be plenty of other game. And I have nowhere to go. Few would dare hire a runaway marksman. I would be glad to follow you. You know, I can hit a squirrel. Alright. Exactly. After dinner we shall set out. Oh, you only need 400 Thalar? Sure. Oh, sure. Your wife, yeah. You can have as much money as you want. We're kind of rich. So, Victor. You look pretty cool. Um, Victor de la Boscor, at your service. Uh, what a man with that name. Are you a Spaniard? I am the heir of the ancient house of roots of the old and new world alike. Buscarders fought in just about every war since the Reconquista. Alright, pretty cool. Perhaps you want to join me, my friend? Such a helper would be... Yeah, sure. Uh, here's 500 Thalar. I don't mind I don't mind spending a little bit of money to pe pick these guys up. So, where have you been since our last encounter? Naturally. Alright, you could be of use to me. Sure. Wow, that's cool that there's so many people here randomly, but I'm kind of... Oh, and two, a pub visitor and a mercenary like cavalryman. Sure, we'll take you for some money. Um, oh, good. All right, awesome. So we can, uh, we can. This Aldergas. Welcome back, my friend. Awesome. So we found everybody we wanted, right? All right. Well, we'll leave for now. Um, Make your preparations, we move at dawn. I'm going to actually talk to him and see if we can't, um, let's talk to our party here and see if we can't get them to show us their equipment and we can steal stuff from them. Damn it. No, we can't. So, Fidot, do you have anything good for me? I don't think we're actually going to steal anything from them. I know we need weapons, but I really wish we didn't lose our pistol. That was really cool. Oh, well, I mean, we are saving up a lot of money for to get the gun. Sorry, my throat hurts a little bit, so having some more soda makes it feel a little better. Anyways, these town militiamen are going to be the least helpful. Um, so let's go back to Slancy. We probably have enough men to scare off the deserters now. Thank God, we have 20. Sweet. All right. Let's see, do they have any good supplies? Oof, hides. Those are going to sell for way more at the... Uh, this at the at the selling place on Narava. Fadot has actually gone up to level seven. Awesome. So party. Hey, low Fadot. Hopefully none of these guys dislike each other. I like to keep them all around. Um, let me see your skills, my friend. Let's put you another point here. We're gonna get somebody. We need somebody with pathfinding ability. Not pathfinding. Sorry. Us. Uh, oh, he's actually a big, pretty good spotter. Awesome. Fadot, you're pretty cool. Let's put you another point in your tracking. Done. Um, no time to talk right now. We've got a lot of good stuff. Tips. He's pretty good at stuff. Spotting and engineering and tactics. Fadot, you're good at pathfinding and tracking. And first aid is good. Is covered by this guy. And uh, these two aren't doing nothing though. That's fine. Let's get these guys up to musketeers. I really like my musketeers, but uh, of course we do need a balance. 
So maybe we'll recruit some uh, mercenary Haldebers from the uh, mercenary camp. You want this vodka? Any of these hides you'll take. Can only use more money. Uh, and then maybe in Narava we can actually find to pick up some more companions because I'm I've been looking for to have a good, a good strong composition. Mercenary musketeers, sure. Ransom broker. I don't think we actually have any prisoners. Yeah, because we, we we did have prisoners at one point, but they all got freed, I guess, when the uh, when we when we fought when we got captured. Good, we have hardly to pay anything. This place sadly got ravaged, I believe, when we uh, failed to eliminate all the enemies that dwelled within. And I believe we can get an unlimited amount of recruits now, am I correct? Attack these bandits. Sure. We have the men, we can do it. They have the training. And I love that our little emblem, our little emblem is so cool. Alright, these morons. Apparently there's no other way to get across but the bridge. And they're too good to get their horse's feet wet, apparently. And we still have no weapon, so crap. We'll, we'll just scavenge for one. Cavalry, go ahead and charge. And um, infantry, go ahead and charge. Alright, we're going to need to dismount. And we'll just wait for a uh, bandit to die or something and we'll go try and take his sword. Or maybe we'll just get one of these guys right here. Yeah, this looks like perfect. Good, so we got an axe. And we're pretty good at one-handed still. Luckily we didn't lose any of our things. I'm going to start yelling. I need to turn the... Well, these guys are pretty loud when we're that close. Ow. 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 Oh god, we need to go find our allies. Oh good, somebody shot the crap out of you. Nice. Thanks, thanks my militia man. It's pretty good. That was nice of you. So hopefully we'll get a musket that we can use from this. Because they let us keep all our armor, which was nice of them. I'm pretty sure the last time we got captured they made us naked. But they didn't take all our stuff, they just moved it off our body. Sweet, we got some more volunteers, and we can buy supplies now from them. We can take these hides, I'm sure we'll sell for more, and we'll buy some food. How about, and we'll trade them the vodka. Can we get... Oh, sweet. Alright, yeah, we'll take that. Now, uh, that's it, right? Yeah, we'll leave here then, and uh, let's go over to Lille. See if we can pick up some more volunteers. And, uh... Yeah, now you're afraid of me, huh, deserters? Let's see, can we catch them? We're 5.4, they're 5.8, so no, we cannot catch them, but uh, maybe eventually. Find the mercenary for Swedish mercenaries. I would like to hire some soldiers. Can I c hire some cavalry? For my, Can I change them to have better melee weapon, long-range weapons? Can I give them... Oh, wow, that's cool. We'll give them the best carbines. Oh cool, we got an achievement. I don't know if you guys can see it on the recording, but uh, we got an achievement called Dressed Up. Awesome. Alright, that's enough for now. How's our... Uh, oh, we have been... That's good. At least our money has been, you know, gaining interest. We got about another fourth grand on that interest in there. So that's cool. So, Dupe Fat Fortress. Let's see. And we... I, Oh, commander, there we go. Speak with the garrison commander. That's what we wanted. All right, we want to recruit some lifeguards or something. What's the best um, Scottish musketeer? Wow, these are so cool. Let's recruit some... Uh, we could probably use some dragoons. And can we recruit more? Oh, let's get some more. Let's just get all dragoons right now. Oh, no, I think it disappeared. Let's get some lifeguards. And a musketeer? No, let's get some um, let's get some Scottish musketeers. Oh, Swedish, uh, Swedish right here, and uh, Crossier. All right, that's all you want. That's so cool! I can't believe we find I found it. Good. Uh, order firearms. Is there a cheap one that we can get? Handcrafted pistol, Dutch pistol, Dutch. No, so. Yeah, I kind of want to get that expensive one. 
because you know they're just so expensive anyways I must go let's go to the uh, let's just go to the marketplace and see if there's an arms a gun ooh that's actually a nice gun let's get that and this carbine so we can shoot it off our horse and there's a saber ooh a balanced two hand well you can't use it on horses bonus against shields let's use a saber though we'll take the saber and it's only five grand so and we have plenty of money we'll just trade them for hides so it's a little bit less and these bullets any good no we have those we have better bullets already Hmm. Thrusting sword is stupid. That's a good gonna be. That's even better than our uh, than our other gun. So I'm happy to find it. Ah, oh, thank God we have a gun. All right, and then we probably want to get some food for all these men. All right, so now we need to come. Oh God, I hate these gra these graphical errors are so terrible. Um. So now we actually have a legitimate army that we've been we've been putting together. Uh, you have any? Let's pick up all the guys we can from. I think that's gonna be enough. That we. I don't think we need any more. So, let's let's continue. Piskov has been besieged. So we need to be careful because we're like floating on the sky. Um. Wow, that's a lot of men. No, don't go to Slantsty. It's such a nice town. Don't don't raid me, please. Come raid Plyve. It's terrible here. Right now, I'd like to say that Fidot is the is not the best in the country. He refers to my homeland of Branks as a native Russian land. So while any man with a hint of education knows they have always been part of Lithuania. If he persists... I kind of like Fidot. Actually, you know what we'll do? We'll just go look at Fidot's equipment and take him. Um, Fidot, you have my support in this. And then he should hold his tongue. So, Fidot, sorry, you kind of suck. Uh, can I see your equipment, my friend? You got any good bullets? Ooh, those bullets are better than ours. Take your bullet, trade you bullets. Is this saber any? No, our saber, our stuff is good. That, that's a nice hat, but our hat is better, so that's good. We're good then, never mind. No time to talk right now. I just wanted to steal all your stuff. We got our upgrades. Yay, upgrades. Yay, upgrades. Good, and then Fidot, sorry, you gotta go. Because you have a problem with my friend. Alright, well, that's it for that. Let's, uh... I think we should test our new units soon, but, um... How long is it going to take for our... We need to go to the town center and go to the commander, uh... Where's our troops? I forget where you picked them up. Crap. I think we actually talked to the other guy to pick... I think we're in Depot's Fortress, so... Never mind. Oh, we'll buy these first because those are cheap. And the fish is cheap as well here. So let's go to Duprat Fortress and see if they've gotten our units yet. So we need to go to the town center and talk to the commander here. Speak with him. So, okay, so we, yeah, see all these things are not, yeah, we're, we're, we need more. Alright. It looks like we've got some, uh, ooh, Muscovite scouts. Let's help the patrol here. We can fight against these Muscovites. We have 47 troops new that we need to test out anyways. Alright, so hang out back here, guys. Um, we're going to have the uh, riflemen up here. And our infantry is going to come back them up in front of them. But, uh... Actually, cavalry charge. Let's see how our gun works. 42 damage. I think that's a little better than we used to get. Oh crap, oh crap, oh crap, oh crap, oh crap. <laughs> Nice. Gun him down. Infantry, you charge as well. Oh, our Swedish right here. Oh, that's pretty... That's our ally. So yeah, our patrol is pretty cool. We got a Dragoon knocked unconscious. Oh no. At least we finally have all of our troops spots filled. Oh. Oh, we missed. Can't believe it. Oh, well, maybe we can hit him here. How long does it, is it taking? It's not as long to reload. That's not so bad. Oh crap! Can I switch to uh, another? Yeah, I don't want to. I didn't want to shoot that off. Where's the enemies? Oh, there they are. Oh, so close. Let's just select our entire party and tell them all to charge. I believe that's the end of the enemies. Yes, they only have one left. We've lost two men, sadly, but that's okay. 
We're still doing we're still doing pretty well pretty well for ourselves. We got one allied dragoon that died. Yeah, no problem. Uh, a dragoon. Ooh, winged hussar. Those guys are sick. Mercenary halberdiers and then looters. We'll hire them, I guess. I mean, we have room in our party, so we might as well. Uh, we'll probably just let's just release those looters. We don't need them. They're just gonna be trash. Now we can actually start to be choosy. Ooh, it's a nice upgrade to our horse. He's a little bit more armor and a little bit more maneuverable and some more hit points too. Sweet. So let's see, um, Cybrian is a dangerous man. He's a good doctor. I uh, would be in, but what is he doing in our party anyway? Uh, Victor, sorry. Cybrian is a valuable member. I don't want you picking any more fights with him. So it looks like we need to get rid of him. So let's, um, let's talk to Victor. Take his good, his nice, sexy hat. Um, well, that's actually a really good armor. I'll trade armor with him then. Since his boots probably match a little better. And wow, that's a good hat. And I'll take your gloves, my friend. And your thrusting sword, you can keep that. <laughs> uh, luckily, I didn't give him a ragged shoes. But, um, anyways, uh, alright, we need to go our separate ways. So now we know that Victor and then the other guy, Sabot, are not, they're not going to be good friends with our current troop. So the winged tossers, we definitely want up front. Mercenary light cavalrymen, then musketeer veterans. These guys are going to be good, too. Mercenary Halderbers are okay. Militia Musketeers are pretty good, too, but we want to upgrade them further until we start trying to use them regularly. Let's see, did they get our troops here in the uh, town just yet? I mean, I, I can't really tell, so whatever. <sighs> Let's go to the marketplace here, see if they want any of this fish. Nope. They'll take the shoes, though. We still, we do look pretty badass now. I must say, for a female. And we have a pretty legit amount of stuff, or a pretty sizable party now, which I'm proud of. How close are we to leveling? Oh, we're actually very close to leveling, and uh, that'll be another point of charisma, I think, is what we're going to start doing. Or no, one more point in intelligence, because it's going to give us just enough to, um, we're going to put a bunch of points in inventory management so we can trade a lot more. Is Piskov still under siege? Some of our soldiers have gotten upgraded. Yay! <laughs> I like their hats. Is there an enemy in here? Who Who is the enemy? I don't think so. I think that's just a flag from the actual town. It's too bad we're still at war. How am I? My god, we are at war with, like... We're at war with him a lot. Like, we've been at the war with him since we started the freaking game. So Piskov and Vilna are alone, no longer under siege, but there's the, um... There's the enemies here. We're gonna recruit some more volunteers. The peasants have any good supplies for us? No. Do they want any of this fur? No, they don't have enough money. Hmm. Let's, uh, let's take a look at our party and see if anybody wants a horse who doesn't have one. Uh, Starburn, how about we give you a horse, my friend? Here you go. Oh, you can't? You don't have riding one? Oh, that sucks. So we need to get you a point in riding next time. Wow, you have, like, nothing, Starburn. You're weak. All you can do is wound treatment and surgery. Might as well put you in the bottom. Let's put him down to the bottom of the list here because we don't need him. To be doing anything. Ooh, hello. Maybe our friend here, King Carl. How are you, Carl? Would you like me to do any? Oh crap! I forgot about that. Um, no special missions. I must make me leave of you. Let's see if we. Uh, let's see if Carl's going over to fight Piskov. Oh no. Oh no! Don't die! Don't die! Oh god! There's so many. Okay, so they're fighting our foragers. Um, King Carl has joined the party. Oh, sweet. All right. Give up, dog. We'll fight you to the end, you you horrible person. 
We have 300 troops against their third. Ooh, this is gonna be such a big battle, I can't wait. And we got our sexy new hat on with our little cool outfit. Now, do we command the entirety of the, uh... Well, I mean, we can at least make our troops do something intelligent. So, marksmen here. Cavalry, you're fine. Infantry in the front. We're gonna start opening fire. Ooh, nice, sweet, we got a, f a f kill. We killed a marksman spearman. Wow, that's a weird combination. Usually the spearmen are to stop cavalry, but... Okay. Marksman killed by... Carl... Sweet. Good job, Carl. Infantry, uh, you can go ahead and charge, too. Nice, we killed another, uh, another marksman. I guess these are their Muscovite units. Carl Gustav. Oh no, he got knocked out by uh, one of the enemies. That sucks. Oh, we should kill these guys. Whoa. Whoa. Hey, do not shoot me. I am a simple marksman. Whoa. He's chasing me like crazy. No, I can't believe we missed that. Oh, well, let's try to get a stable firing position before this guy comes. Nice. Oh. Nice. We got 67 experience for that kill. Sweet. We're getting up there. Keep firing, militiamen. You're doing great. Nice. Shot that stupid spear marksman spearman. It's a very weird combination. How about we cut this guy's head off? There we go. Bye bye, Pasand marksman. I remember having those guys on my side. I, I guess they got them from the same place I did. Oh. No, not my Swedish. No, not a musketeer. Die. <gasps> Whoa, we killed a warlord. Interesting. That was 176 experience. Sweet. I can't believe we haven't leveled up yet. It's really weird. They still have more troops over here, though. But we're still shooting, so I think we're fine. How about I stop here? I'll cut these guys up. I mean, we clearly are going to win. I mean, there's no way we're going to lose, right? Right. We got our winged hussar. Those guys are ridiculous. I, I've read about them on the wiki. They're insanely good units. The fact that we recovered them, I have no idea how they died. How did we, like, how did they die that we were there to recover them? You know? Oh, and apparently there's some people down here. Could probably open fire on these guys down there in the ravine. And take our let's take our marksman up here. Just to finish them off. Oh, there's the uh there's another winged hussar doing his Is that our winged hussar? He is our winged hussar. Yay! I love those hussars, they're so cool. Where's my party? My party, come meet me up here. I wanna see how many we actually brought to the Awesome. I think we just won, right? No, oh, they have one enemy f left. Oh, down here. Nice. We were able to get the last kill. 67 experience. Sweet. I still can't believe we haven't leveled up yet. It's ridiculous. We're like we're like 80 experience away. And we gained two renown. Sweet. So they have 78 troops left. We'll charge them. Awesome. I'm just gonna let my troops go. I mean, I'll take my marksmen and put them in a good spot, though. Before we get up, you know, too close. Man, this this shirt is so swagorious. It's so deliciously swagorous. <sighs> All right, here. Um, marksmen, I guess you can hang out up here. How about that? Or maybe a little bit more. Ow! Crap! Thirty damage. Now that almost killed us. Oh, and I think the rifles are on the other side, like the, um, the pistol was this side, but the rifles are this side, so I can, it's like, just like Mountain Blade Warband with the, uh, horse. Die. I love charging, like, because if I charge them to death, it's so, because I can, I can knock them out that way, which is hilarious. So this is like our first, like, successful venture into f fighting the, uh, mounted, or fighting actual people. Which is awesome. No, don't shoot me, don't shoot me, don't shoot me. Yes. Ha ha ha. 
my god. They're all just standing over here, aren't they? Right, night, right in the noggin. I'm gonna try to interrupt their reloads. Oh crap, oh crap. We need to get out of here, we need to get out of here. No, no, no. Oh no. So we retreated. Well, we're gonna just order to attack. Alright, we were unable to get a decided victory. Oh good, we finally defeated the enemy. Alright, whatever, some script and okay. That's weird. We'll capture these prisoners then. Thank god we won. And the militia musketeer. Yay. Ooh, another ooh, a chipped poleaxe. Cool. Oh, sweet, and we've advanced to level twelve. I knew that would happen. Alright, so we're gonna put a point into intelligence. That'll finish off the, we've got up to twelve now. Twelve twelve twelve, except for charisma, then we'll we'll start putting points there soon. We're gonna put two points into inventory management, so it'll make our inventory a little bit bigger. Duh. And then we'll put some into one and then we'll we'll save that one point for later. Uh how's our party? We're thirty five out of thirty, so a good thing we commissioned all those units. Um let's see, is there a is there a guy in the tavern here? A Piskoff? Um, where's the, um, oh, no ransom broker. We'll take these mercenary light cavalrymen, though. Alright, that's it. Alright, we're just gonna try to follow this guy, our king. See if we can't get into some more decisive battles, maybe? Nah, I don't want to fight those guys. There's a tiny patrol. Let's see if we can't kill that patrol. Come on, little patrol. You know you want to fight me with my king. My god, that king has a lot of units. Maybe I should try to catch him. Let's see. I'm just going to click on him, and I should be the one that starts the engagement if it does so start. Now, if it if it says... Oh, good. He joined on our side. Um, I say this only once. Surrender or die. Yeah, we have... Oh, they've retreated to the camp. Alright, we're going to attack on horseback. Is this a, um... Why can't I zoom in with this? Oh, it's shift. I was like pressing the wrong button. All right. Uh, I mean, I guess we can just charge. I mean, I don't see why not. Fifty damage, and that did nothing. Oh, well, this these wagon forts are supposedly formidable, but apparently not. Especially since we have the numbers advantage. As long as we get our Troops around. Let's get my marksmen and have them hang out right at the front of the line. Sweet a lifeguard. 43 damage. We're doing so much damage, but they're not dying. Oh well, at least our marksmen are up there next to the wall now. And they should. They, like, the wall provides them as much defense now as it does the enemy. And the enemy is actually kind of st stupid for actually going back there because look they're just getting like just shot from all angles and new reinforcements are arriving okay that's not even worth oh god oh god oh god I better move I, I know there's just one of these morons is gonna try to shoot me and then they're gonna succeed and they'll shoot me and I'll just freaking be dead that's kind of funny watching the uh, watching my men just just mow them down from across the aisle there it's kind of funny Alright, well, we want to be careful because we don't want to just catch a stray bullet meant for one of our men. Headshot, and it didn't kill him? Ooh, there's these guys routing. Nice. We have, we have the numbers advantage entirely, but apparently there's only 10 enemies left. We did some damage to a horse, that's fine. We still get experience for that. Hopefully we don't lose too many of our men right there on the front lines. Oh god, oh god, oh god. Nice! We actually killed a Moscow right here. 
Awesome. And there goes the last of the enemies. Yay, and I didn't die this time. Wow, how's that? That's a miracle. Alright, so we won. And uh, we only lost uh, seven men. So they have one troop left. Of course, this is going to be the guy that snipes me, but I'm going to run out there and try to get him. As ill-advised as that may seem, I'm going to try. Oh good, he's uh, on horseback, so maybe I can just shoot him. He doesn't look like he's aiming anything, so... Oh, well, I shot him. I didn't... I just didn't get the kill. Ow! Crap. Wow, I can't believe he didn't kill me. I guess we had the same horizontal velocity, so that, like, allowed him to actually kill me. Or shoot me, rather. Whatever. My lifeguard, or the lifeguard of my ally, killed him. Man, that must hurt, that arrow. Ow. Oh, wow, we actually rescued quite a few prisoners. Sweet. So we can hire all these guys to replace all the units that we just lost. Cursier. Ooh, lifeguard. I love their outfit. Sorry, I got a lot of, um, I've been drinking that stupid soda. It makes me a little bit burpy. A dragoon. Yay. Raytier. Veteran. Awesome. Crusier. Marks in the secret department. They've been pretty good to me. Muscovite marksman, I guess. Mil militia pikemen. Militia pi Why are these not in the same... Why are there three different types of militia pike? I'm not taking this crap. That's stupid. They're the only ones that can be upgraded. Let's take a volunteer. And this cavalry. Wow, we almost have a full party. Interesting. Done. And ooh, they had a vodka for us. Sweet, we can go trade that somewhere. Alright. Good job, King Goose Carl. We're doing pretty badass, aren't we? Uh, we got some guys to be upgraded, which is even sweet. Move down this guy with the injury. Alright, well, that's going to about do it for this episode, guys. I hope you enjoyed. It looks like we're doing a pretty good job defending our new uh, leader, you know, their realm. So it's pretty fun. And then we and look at this horrible map error. Whatever. Anyways, I'll see you guys in the next episode. Hopefully that's fixed. Anyways, uh, spray and pray out.